Oh, another medal for Underwood in the relays. Uh, this one comes in the sprint med, taking home fifth. Ladies, big day for, for you guys. What are the thoughts? I'm really excited. We did. We placed better than we were expecting. We just knew we had to get first or second in our heat to place. Yeah, I'm so happy that we placed, and we did really good today. Yeah, it's super exciting, especially because this is something that we didn't really expect. Yeah, like they said, coming in, we weren't top eight, but... We knew being in the second heat, if we got first, I would have a chance, and we ran a PR, so that was really good for us. Where do you feel the success came from today? Why did you guys run as well as you did? Uh, I think our handoffs were really good. Um, my lead legs got me in a really good spot, so I just tried to keep it um, in that four, and we did really good. Tyler, what were your thoughts on today? Um, it went pretty well. We kind of had a messed up handoff, but it was fine, and then we got her in a, a pretty decent spot, and she got out really fast, so that helped us. Haley, speak to your leg. Uh, where do you feel you did well? Um, I think our handoff went really well. Like I got out fast enough. And, yeah, so. Taylor, senior year. Uh, it's been a busy one for you so far. Uh, has it sunk in yet? It's been sinking in, yeah. I have one more race left, and then I'm done with my senior year. Well, Audubon finishes third here in the Sprint Medley today in Class 1A. Uh, ladies, a really strong field. Top three finish. What are the thoughts? Um, I was just happy with how it ended. It's pretty cold out, so I was just happy with how we performed, and everyone just gave it their all. Honestly, I, I got out really strong. Me and Maddie had a good handoff, and me and Abby had good handoffs, and we knew we had to have a good mindset with the cold, so it came out pretty good, so I'm happy with the results. Yep, coming into mine, getting the handoff, it looked like we were already in a good place, and having the cold advantage and knowing what to do with it really helps. Just like these three other ladies said, they all had extremely good handoffs, everybody had good splits, and I knew that I had to also do the same and uphold my requirements with these girls. Hannah, this has been a, a busy week really for all you guys, but as a senior, um, what has it meant for you to have the weekend you've had? Um, it's a little bittersweet. It's my last time running here for high school. Um, hopefully I'll run here at the collegiate level for Drake. Um, but. I, I mean, I'm kind of speechless. This has just been a really good opportunity for us. It's a once-in-a-lifetime thing that you can have while you're in high school, and I'm really glad that these girls were a part of it with me. This is a group that's had a lot of success this season and this week. Uh, what is it that makes this group click? Um, everybody shows up every day for practice. We work hard. We push each other. Uh, we have a positive atmosphere. And, I mean, we're just really good friends, so it just kind of clicks really well. <laughs> Yeah, being a senior with the same group of girls I came to stay with in almost every event last year, it just makes sense, and I love it that we know each other so well, and we know if we're going to maybe be coming in slower, coming in faster, and we just know what to do in the moment, so I'm glad for that. I really look up to these two senior girls. They've been a huge leader for me. Um, I'm just so grateful for this opportunity, and I can't believe that we've made it here two years in a row. You know, we didn't have a freshman season for me, and they've been just amazing girls to work with, and some of my best friends and I'll never forget these memories. Yeah, like they all said, we're just really good friends in and out of running and we just all click really well together and we just show up and yeah. All right, well, the Mountaineer girls finished second, 1A sprint medley. Uh, ladies, quite the race, oh so close to a state title, but, but runner up, what are the thoughts? Um, I knew starting out the race I had to get out hard so we could get the stick first to the next girl. We knew we needed to get the stick passed off to Addie first so she could get a good lead, knowing that the lane five was our 400 state champion in the 400 meters. Uh, we've been battling with like cold weather all year, so I think we were like really strong and we've been used to this. And talking to coach before, our last gold medal was with uh, Melissa Friedrich, so we were really hoping to go for that, but we still like made Raider at history, so I think we're proud. Just practicing getting the handoffs good and just getting the stick to Addie so she could get a good lead on that 400 runner. Yep. Um, so I was really hoping to get it in the lead, and I feel like they came in and brought it in really close, if not in first. And I know with the cold weather, I needed to get out hard and use this wind and stay loose because that was, I think, my problem in my open four was I got a little tight because of the heat. So this is perfect conditions to go and run a really fluid four. And I felt like I did that. And she got me in the open four. And I tried my best to get her this time, but just didn't quite get there. So I thought it was good race. And we had a big PR. Um, so we reset the school record. So it's exciting regardless.
I know you're not done yet, but uh, what has this week been like for you? Um, you know, this accomplishment, your own individual accomplishments, watching your brother win state titles. As a senior, is this kind of your career coming full circle? Oh, for sure. It's been a fun but emotional weekend. It's my last track weekend. It's my last time running and running on the Blue Oval. And to watch my brother go and achieve what he wanted to this year was awesome, even though I didn't quite get which we still have the Open too, but not good a gold medal yet, but it made the weekend so much better watching him succeed, and we've had our best season so far, I think. How gratifying is it uh, as a relay put forth the work all year to have it end as high as it did? It's fun. We've been running, running this race almost every single meet throughout the season, so just to see everybody uh, improve their times and just get faster and I don't, I don't know. We just feel like we gelled and became more of a team every single time we ran it. I think it helps that we're all so close together and it's just been a fun weekend running with them and I wish I had more time with them. Yeah, to piggyback off of what she said, like we're really close and we all get along so well and I think the team chemistry is really what makes our team so good. Yep, it helped that we ran a lot of different relays together, so we got to practice all of our handoffs multiple different times, and we had two good seniors that were leaders to us to help me and Jaxie, like, gel with them, and we all get along really well, so. Mount Air takes fourth in the 1A Sprint Med today. Uh, good day for Mount Air so far. Gentlemen, what are the thoughts on today? Um, obviously, we wish we could have placed a little higher, but I mean, 135.9 is a good time, RPR for the season. Um, things could always went smoother, but they could have went a lot worse too. So overall, I think it was a good, it was a good race for us. We all are fairly happy with the result. Uh, the biggest thing for all of us was overcoming the adversity we were faced with yesterday of getting disqualified in the 4x4, put down a good time in that. But we knew we needed to come back and run a good sprint med. We just got mentally prepared. Yeah, how tough was it to regroup after, uh, you know, I'm sure you guys had big goals in the 4x4. Four four. Uh, that was probably crushing, but to regroup, how big was that? Yeah, it was big. I mean, we knew that we were going to put it on a good time in the 4x4, four four, and we did. But once that hit that we were DQ'd, we just knew we had to move on. And just it came together as a group. What is it that makes this relay as successful as it's been? Uh, the four of us have been together on a lot of relays all year, and we got a really good bonding together. So, team, a lot of team bonding between us, and I don't know. We pray before every race, and that's about it. Rice, uh, this caps what's been a very, very productive state meet for you. Uh, when you look back on it, what are you going to remember? Um, I'm definitely going to remember running with these guys. Uh, running this race this morning in the sprint mid, I knew it was going to be the last time. Uh, running with Austin and Adler, so um, I just wanted to go out and um, run my best, and I knew we would, and uh, we ran a good PR, and we ran a good time, so I'm fairly happy. The state meet go kind of the way you thought it would? Uh, maybe I know the 4x4 four four you would have liked a different result, but aside from that, what are your thoughts? Well, it's been better than I would have imagined coming. I, I came and I wasn't expecting anything. Um, not only one, but two state championships. That's, uh, that's amazing. And um, has just everything I expected and more. So um, it's a great meet and I've had a great weekend.